there, pal. All Thanks right. for the tip. It took two casts downwind on your recommendation, and I got one on. It. Well, it's much easier to work that jig when you're casting downwind, isn't it? The line gets a little loopy for a novice like myself. Are you going to need a frame of I have no idea. You tell me. Nah, we'll... Hey, that's a nice walleye there. Come on, walk him up to the camera here. Coming around. All right, all right. No, Ryan, you get, like I say, you watch us fish every day, but isn't it more fun to catch them on those plastics than live bait? It's, well, it's definitely not uh, nice not to have to dunk your hand in that cold, cold minnow bucket water. But did you, could you see your line kind of flip when you when he bit? Uh, I saw it a little bit, and then I felt uh, one tug, and I tugged back, and here's the result. Here we go, Ryan. Here we go, buddy. Here we and go, walleye number two. Uh, I don't know. Oh, look at it. It's a crappie. Look at that. It's a crappie. Nice crappie. Wow, beautiful. On that plastic, too, Ryan. Is that nice or what? He went after a big bait there. You know, it's kind of interesting this time of the year, folks, when you get up to northern Wisconsin or northern Minnesota, what I like to look for is, is live weeds, weeds that are still green. And a lot of times that'll hold fish this time of year. But I can't believe that crappie hit that big jerko. So what I did was put a mark in the hummingbird, Ryan, if we want to come back here a little bit later and try that with bobber and minnows. Hey, 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 way to go there, Ryan. What do we got, buddy? You need a frabo? Fish number two of the day. Do Let's... we need a frabo? I am. Yeah, probably. Well, no, well, I'm trying to flip it. Let's see if you can do the good old flip. Uh, I don't know about that, John. <laughs> all right, all right, buddy. Well, you can see me do it, right. man. Oh, there you go. Hey, that's a nice <laughs> walleye, nice. buddy. Nice. That's got to be my biggest of the photographer outing so far, I would say. How are your hands holding up there? Oh, they're going to be good when I touch this cold fish. Yeah, I know. Whew. But you know what? It is interesting. You know, a lot of guys don't think the walleyes will bite, you know, on, on plastics and quick moving baits when it gets cold. They're hitting it pretty good. Yeah, and I'm popping it a little bit more aggressively than you are and uh, just trying something different, you know, so. Beautiful colored walleye. Walk up and show the folks, man. That is a nice walleye. Are you, I'm are, a jerko. Are you enjoying Photographer Day? It's awesome. It's uh, nice to get a fish in the boat.